Now we've all used carp barrows for donkey's years. Now in all fairness, bad backs, bent elbows, we've all used them and realized there are problems with them. And there you go. So what we've done now is enter Transit X, okay? The main problem with barrows over the years has been the ground clearance with the legs. So what we've done, we've shortened the legs, okay? So you don't have to bend your elbows anymore because the old ones were like that, trying to get the barrow over the bumps and lumps on the path. So we've shortened the legs and we've give you adjustable arms. So whatever height you are, whatever shape and size, um, this will adapt to you. So you've got a straight back and straight arms and it's easier to push, okay? So there we go, Transit X, loads of sense there. Sidebars, now these are not adjustable, they're detachable and you can either use the sidebars of your bed chair or your legs of your bed chair as the sidebars or just keep these on. Undo them, there we go, and that just pops off then. As I say, they're not adjustable, they're completely detachable. We'll leave that off for now so we can show you. But they do fold down for when packing it away in the vehicle and so does the front bar which has got a handy little bag on the front. Now I use that for waterproof clothes, small light stuff on there. This, again, is the first hard top on the barrow. You can either work from this for day sessions and you use it again to cover up the internal luggage area. Our Transit 2 fits about as snug as you can get in there. Okay. And the front ones, again, water bottles, petrol bottles for your cookers. Keep that nearer the front because that's where your weight's got to be to help the barrow move. Now, if you're not into this real deluxe version that we do, we do just a transit, normal, scaled down, sort of stripped down version of this as well. Slightly cheaper, it's not any lighter, but there you go. Your choice is yours. Transit X and Transit Carp Barrows.